snugly tucked between the Arabian Sea on the west and the Sayadri Mountains on the east, Goa, a petite state of the Indian Union, exudes western influences despite its eastern location. Its beautiful silvery beaches draw as many visitors as the waves that crash upon its shores. Temples, churches, mosques and other shrines are testimony to the religious tolerances of the place. Fontenish, the Latin quarter of the city, stands as a proud example of Portuguese culture, with its quaint houses, typical of old Lisbon, drawing tourists aplenty. Goa is a riot of colour during the carnival celebration. The three-day festival begins with a float parade where King Momo reads his decree, directing his subjects to have fun. Open-air dances and fancy dress competitions are part of the carnival celebration. Dances and gala balls are held at feasts and other celebrations. The sound of the dhol, tasha and mand beating a staccato rhythm heralds the shigmo celebrations that usher in spring. Music is a passion for the Goans. in Goa. Putting it out in front of a wood-fired oven, the local baker prepares the tasty pao for the Goan breakfast. The nut of the cashew apple is one of Goa's major exports. The heady brew feni, of which even a whiff is enough to intoxicate, is extracted from the cashew apple. This gone drink is matchless in the whole world.
Polri pjeri tu i do kjeri falja kaj me ona Us një festa orsa kitak ton pa u pjena With the Hindu community being in majority, there are many temples in the land. Among these, the Mangeshi temple is the most famous. Where the elephant-headed god of wisdom is brought to the house, venerated and then immersed in the river. The Muslim community offers namaz at the mosques, of which there are quite a few in Goa. On 3rd December, the feast of St. Francis Xavier. Within the Basilica of Bom Jesu lie the sacred relics of the saint. Preceding Holy Week, 30 statues of the Franciscan order are taken in procession in the village of Goa Velia. A unique procession, this one is held only here and in Rome. A procession of Christ carrying the cross is taken out in every parish. and confreres in their customary garb and children dressed as angels lead the procession with the faithful following. A brass band is also a feature of the village feast.